The Bible says in the book of Ecclesiastes chapter 3 that there is a time for everything and a season for every activity under the heavens. A time to be born and a time to die. To the family of the late Mweze Bona Bridget Ifeyungwa IBC, Ne Osemeka, of Umude village Onisha, in Onisha North local government area of Anambra State, having lived slightly above the biblical three scores and ten years, the Lord called home their beloved mother, whose burial mass was celebrated at St. Mary's Catholic Church on Asia. I heard so much about her and I knew her as someone who is generous and open. She was a great teacher uh, from many testimonies from her students and those I met. From the church, remains of the deceased were conveyed to the husband's compound for final burial rites and interment with members of Catholic Women Organization on ground. Because she was inducted into the prestigious Otuadu Society of Furniture in 2016, where she took the name Mweze Bona. Members of the prestigious society were also on ground to do the needful. Described by many, including her lovely sister, Shime Bunye Menu Chibogo of Fia, as a quintessential mother, sister, in law, and a friend who touched many lives positively and left her footprints on the sands of time. Relatives, friends, well-wishers and professional colleagues from within and outside Nigeria thronged the deceased family compound to pay their last respect. She was such a wonderful woman. She loved everyone. She never found any fault in anybody. And so I celebrate her today. She's somebody people can vouch for anytime, any day. A teacher and not just a teacher but uh, a guidance and counselor and she has used that to impart in people's lives she was very kind she was very patient she was very loving and she used to come to Suka where we lived to take me to Lagos on summer holidays she made my childhood memorable so basically she was like a second mother to me and we were very close I um, cannot describe how we feel having lost a human being like that. She was not only my sister, but she was a kind and loving human being. She was a very peaceful person. She was a wonderful person, always smiling. She's a woman that is loved by all. And this is a very sober mo moment for us. She was kind to everybody, took everybody as her own. I'll say a red gem is gone. Where is the born now, Ife Yungwa Bridget IBC, who died at 72, is survived by children, grandchildren, and host of other relations. <laughs> Monitor, Junior Fisi Okoye, NTA News.